Hey yo, welcome back everybody. Late night Uncle Karius grind. I was about to say Nunderson. I really wanted to say Nunderson. So if you didn't catch the stream, I did a stream. We're starting up streams with Uncle Karius. And uh I don't know if I mentioned it during a video. I think I did. We got a little Titanic in the works. Um I gotta fix the shape of the boat. There's something about this shape that looks really weird. <laughs> I mean, I was looking up cruise ships, and that's what they look like. If you don't know what that is, that's an iceberg. I got a burp. Hold up. I tried to do as far away as possible, but I can only go so far in this creaky chair. You hear this? I need a new chair. Donate me money so I can buy a new chair. All right. Um, You don't have to. But today's episode, we're hopefully going to fight at least two bosses. I'm aiming for Granite Energy Storm Berry Champion. That's the goal. But uh, real quick. I need to make as many accessories as I can from this mod before, you know, they're useless because I want to actually have some usefulness from these accessories before they're gone. What is this? Oh, I didn't even know you could do that. That's amazing. I need to do that. I need some of the crate pad that greatly helps you fish. It helps you too? Bro, I didn't even know that. What? I got goddamn. I'm being enslaved over here. You guys want to see something cool during the live stream? Uh, I, I, uh, what the fuck? Explored? No. I found something cool. Not found. I was researching things and I found them on accident. Right here. We got some more gnomes. Shout out to Chad. Um, I don't know if Chad knows about me. Chad, if you know about me, uh, just, just like the video. I don't know. I, I have a feeling, I hope the creator of Chad's Furniture, which is, I'm assuming, is Chad, knows that i was the uh, creative mind behind autismo wait <sighs> no that enemy we just killed there's something you can catch from it Dude, what the hell even killed it do i have a summon out i don't remember attacking that enemy but uh, as you can see there's a gnome with a wheelbarrow borrow is a borrow barrel uh there's one with a fishing hook which is very nice, you know, very convenient that I'm doing a fishing playthrough and there's a fishing gnome. And they got the little cute gnome house. I like the description for it. It says, not to be confused with a mushroom, which it looks like. It's very true that it does look like a mushroom. So, let's go ahead and try and make some accessories here. Might as well just look at everything while we're at it. Uh, this is Bob Escalation Potion. Which we saw was used for something before I got sidetracked and lost whatever it was used for. Can we make this? The star mix stuff. I think we should probably make this. We, we might be doing some major upgrades this episode. But this right here. I wanted to make this. Mana shield chef. Up to 50% of all damage received is deducted from your mana instead. Which is actually really good. Really good. And then we got my mana escalation real. Increased barber damage by 2% each second but cost 8 mana per second. Also really good. Like are these not good? Am I just tripping? I might be tripping. Maybe I need some new shoes. But uh, let's see. How much... Demonite do I have? We got a good bit. Let's make it 30 though. And uh, how do you make star mix? I forgot how to make star mix. Shit, I don't even have that option to make it. Star mix. Is it one word? I don't know if it's one word. It's two words. So, boom. How do we make it? So just gel and stars. We have all of our stars inside of here. We don't have any gel inside of here. So let's go ahead. Let's toss like 300. Hopefully that's good enough. I had a burp right there, but I held it in. You're welcome. I remember this one time I burped during the episode. People were like disgusted. I'm like, sorry, I'm human. I just, just, just got done eating. It's a very late night dinner, but I just ate some food. Can I eat food? Don't want me to drink smoothies? Hey, donate some money and I'll start drinking smoothies. For a living. Well, no, not for a living. What the fuck am I talking about? Alright. So we need 10 star mix, 3 mana crystals. I, didn't we have extra mana crystals at one point in time? That's not expo mana. Yeah, look. We got one right there. Alright, let's make some more. We're gonna make 6. I don't know. I feel like 6 is a good number. And then let's make the star mix. Good old star mix. Wait, where do you craft it at? What am I missing? Oh, I never put the gel in there. What the hell? What's wrong with me? I gotta talk to that traveling merchant because I really want to make the void. I feel like the void is like 
high key one of the most useful accessories in the game. Because I don't know how the hell we're going to beat future bosses. We'll see how strong we get later on. But like dog, how the fuck are you going to beat dog as a fisher? Man? You know what I'm saying? I'm not trying to doubt my boy Uncle Karius, but it may not be the easiest task. All right, let's see here. We're going to need a lot. I think maybe we should start with the armor. I don't know. Now let's do let's just do the shaft first. So let me gather up all the materials. How about this? I'm gonna gather up all the materials to make everything. And I will see you guys in a second. Because I wanna get to the action. All right, we are back. Wait, did I even gather enough star mix? I don't know. We did a lot of fishing right there. But look, we got our armor here. Increase skill by six. Oh, yeah, this is a direct upgrade. I'll let you guys give double defense in hard mode. This is going to be good armor to have in hard mode. What's the set bonus? Increase efficient damage and boss speed. You know what I'm going to miss from the meteorite right set? My minions that spawn in. That thing, it was so useful having minions spawn in. But it's all good. I upgraded my storage too. So hopefully we don't run out anytime soon. Honestly, we should be good for like a while because I don't even need to build anymore. Maybe I will just because I want to make it even. But we should be good for a while. Moving on. Star mix. No, mana escalation something. So it's called something like that. Mana escalation real rod shaft. Mana shield shaft, not escalation. That, I think this one is escalation. Yeah. So we just need two more star mix. Sweet, that's easy. So I need 40. All right, we got fucking teleporting dude. Rebellious what spirit? Boy, if you can get your skull fucking looking ass. Uh, what are we making? We're making the star stuff. 
That should be good. What is that? Star mirror? Okay, completely different mod. But yeah, let's make it. We should be good. Boom, bada, bing. Boom, bada, bing. So let's head to spawn now. And we're going to get rid of this shield accessory. Even though, honestly, I should probably get rid of the Omni Lure. Eh, we'll keep the shield. We'll get rid of Omni Lure. Because it's not the most useful accessory. Maybe it is. I don't remember what it does. Okay, that's pretty damn useful. We'll keep it. We'll get rid of the shield. I don't need two shields. I already got the I Cthulhu one. Who needs more than one? Let's reforge it at least. Give me some warding, please. That would be a very, very nice. So we're looking for purple. That's usually how I tell when to start reforging. I look for the color. Well, then I just read everything. We've gotten quick multiple times already. Which is very nice. It's costing two gold per thing. Okay. At least it didn't take that long. But there you go. Let's get rid of this. Is this used for anything else? Yeah, it is. Oh, we'll keep it. We got storage. Might as well. Is anything... Is anything in these crates? No. Just checking. So, peep this. Look how many chests we have. I'm trying to obviously make that crate thing. But look how many... Not chests. Crates. Look how many crates we have. We're going to save them for hard mode, though. We're going to save all our crates for hard mode. Because once we enter hard mode... Whew, whew, we're going to be stacked. Plain and simple. Plain and simple. Alright, so what I'm going to do now... I'm going to cut... Until I find one of the uh, bosses. Either the granite one or the marble one. And uh, I will see you guys then. I'm just trying to chop up this episode. Because I feel like it's already been going for a while. So I'll see you guys in a second. Cut the video. Alright, so a lot of people ask me. Like, Game Raiders, buy the... Or they don't ask me. They tell me to buy this stuff in the diver. I don't think... Honestly, in my opinion, it's not that good. But it might be better than what we have right now. This is a sword. Oop, 16 damage. Eel rod and a marine launcher. So this is what I was talking about. They're not that good. Uh, <laughs> do I even want to waste the gold to show them off? They're not that good, guys. I know people keep on telling game right just buy them. I keep forgetting because he lived down there in the boat. But uh, he's dead now. And this is a different one. Uh, we could get release burst electric sprites or chance to paralyze the boss monsters. Um, <sighs> Yeah, I guess we'll do that one. Whoa! There you go. That's the only one I'm showing off. You guys should know Lil, Torpe Lil Torpe. You guys should know all of them if you watch the playthrough for a little bit. And if you don't know all of them, you can like you play the mod yourself. Boom bada bing. Two for one. You get to play a great mod, that being Thorium. And you get to experience the weapon. That's a two for right there. That's two for one right there. If you didn't know what a two for was. Um, we're gonna fight this dude and hopefully not die. I don't know, this boss is kind of tough. But I, I have hope in us that we won't die. Let's do it. Let's do it. Can we... Oh, that's not good. That is not good. Oh, man. This is really not good. What the heck? I didn't expect this. Okay. I forgot that he summons in a bunch of enemies around him. So the goal is... No, no, no. I'm using the wrong rod. There you go. Now we're good. Oh, look how nice the text look. It looks so nice. That little black outline does numbers. I bet it had the black outline before. I just never paid attention to it. So when he goes into this stage, honestly, we could just stay attached to him like this and just dodge him. I think this is the way we should do it. Do I got all my accessories? Yeah, I got all the right accessories. Honestly, I don't give Omni Lure enough credit. 15% more damage is a lot more damage. Just look how much he gets chunk for. Right, he's at 5971 and he wants a 700. That was 200. It's doing 200 a tick. Maybe less than 200, but it's doing a lot. Yeah, it's doing less than 200. It's doing like a upper, upper high 100s. It's like I'm telling the damn weather. Today in the forecast, we got a high 100s. This dude does zero damage though. I think what's helping us a lot is that endurance potion. 10% reduced damage. I'd like to see you try. What do these things do? This gives you a debuff. I don't know what they do. <laughs> They're just kind of there. I don't know you do get a debuff. Granite Surge. Lower defense. That's actually a really strong debuff. Dude, I didn't see the sandstone part right there. That's messing up my arena. Dodging strats. Because I was going to dodge and then go all the way around. I mean, we can go all the way around. But we're leaving the arena. There we go. Nice and easy. Kind of boring, but it's a fisherman playthrough. What, you expect me to do some crazy shit? Not right now. Not right now. We ain't doing nothing crazy. Let's pop that baby open. Nothing useful for us. I mean, we can use this. 
I allow that. That's that's an allowable thing. But it's kind of pointless still, so there's no point in using it. But yeah, let's go ahead and keep it. Let's go ahead and cut to the next boss. That being... Ooh, that looks kind of cool. That being the Burry, ch the Burry Champion. All right. I'm having a lot of trouble finding it, but I did find something just as cool. A mini boss. Where is he at? Where is it at? Corpse Bloom. Mini boss time. Let's use this. I know people will get mad if I don't use this. Maybe not mad, but people would rather me use this. Hold up. Go ahead, drink that. But let's beat. See, this thing ain't that good if we're just being a little bit honest. We had to get this very early on in the playthrough. You know what weapon doesn't get much love from me? This. Let's use it. And it's a really strong weapon. It's just, it's, you have to, look how close I have to get to use it. That's tough, bro. That's a tough weapon to use. But yeah, I'm having a lot of trouble finding this marble bomb. I'll be honest, I haven't been searching. Can we not? I haven't been. Oh, okay, there you go. I was about to say. But we done did diddly found it. The next part is gonna be getting the damn enemy to spawn. This should be tremendo. All right, so the boss. Oh, okay. Something real stupid just happened. <laughs> the boss spawn. As you can see, you can see the scraps of the boss statue in the corner. It spawned because the thing landed in lava. Like, you know, you guys know how you spawn that boss, right? There's a little statue that spawns in randomly. And you kill that statue. The statue spawned in lava. So the boss spawned in when I had no health and it killed me. Alright, you know, it's like 3 a.m. in the morning. I got work tomorrow at like 3. So I gotta like, I gotta edit this and get a bunch of stuff done. We're gonna end this episode off here blame rng fuck you rng